Hello everyone, welcome back. Let's play Final Fantasy XV with me, Get Dave Dio. So, off screen, I spent some ascension points, got a healing move called Regroup, and some stat boosts. Also bought a CD for the soundtrack of Final Fantasy II. I'll show you all about it. Welcome to the Crow's Nest. What would you like? Well, this guy's very matter of fact. Happy to tell you about the area. Yeah, map point me. Hmm. Leading us to a map point way down there. All right. Have a look at the menu. Jetties. For status immunity. Wow, this is bonkers good. I don't think I'm going to be spending that much money, though. Thanks for your business. And we're not going to do any hunts right now. If I need money or experience points, I'll check those out later. Alright, let's proceed with the story, shall we? Man, we've got to hop in that, hop in that car now. Front! You all came all the way out here to deliver the goods. Well, that accent does not fit with y'all. Get out of the trunk, so you all just sit tight. Hmm? Wow. Umbra, bringing us stuff. Had a boy. How can you possibly recognize that dog? Track of sand. Really? Someone knows how to find us. Really? How do you really? always know, boy? Just a sec. Nice flower. It's the same kind we sewed our crowns from. Oh yeah, sill blossoms. So, hmm? I have a favor to ask. Take the notebook with you when you go. That way sure. if you forget me. That's not all. I want you to put something in the book and send it back. Did he? What will you do? Have we not seen her in 12 years? All right. All set. Take care out there. Later, I dog. Know. You're not gonna tell me. Then don't ask. What was that about? <sighs> yeah, what you was that about? Say. Game. Now that our work's done, let's see ourselves to Golden. Are you serious? That we, we just came here to talk to a dog. I can get behind that. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, that's the inn. Quest. Alright. Hold on a sec, sir. I found an envelope addressed to Meldasio inside the package. Meldasio? The Hunter HQ? Yes, sir. The head hunter ought to be around here somewhere. Mind making one more delivery? Oh, what sure. do you say, Noct? Might as well while we're in the neighborhood. Sure. We'll do a side quest. The last one went so well. I swear I can do this. All right. We were talking about how it would be nice to go rolling in the car. Hope you agreed with me. So... Return to where we parked the car? Eight feet from us. <laughs> Alright, we learned a lot about that setting, or that feature, but we did it in a safe setting. We've also got ourselves a nice... Uh, quick travel. So, I really should have taken care of this, so... Yeah, we'll throw $10 away forever and fast travel to get there. Might want to stock up on potions and stuff. Nice. You're being helpful for a change. What do you mean, for a change? 
Whoa now. Refuel? I don't know. Do we need? Looks like we're doing okay. You know, we, we could have done that ourselves. I guess they just wanted an ass shot. You know, I guess we've had a flashback with Luna Freya, but we... <laughs> All pretty again. Take care of her, you hear? Yeah. Um, we've seen a flashback of a, a girl, but aside from that, the only female character has been uh, Sydney. Oh, Anita Sarkeesian's gonna have a heyday with this, and she's gonna be right. All right, let's go kill that thing. I was meaning to do it, kind of. I kind of was like, ah, maybe we'll just do the plot parkour. But now, now it's time. So, uh, you thinking to fairy tale Lady Lunafreya back to the Crown City? Nah, no need to rush to happily ever after. Whoa! Wow, still can't probably shouldn't you're be getting married then. Not, dude. How does it feel now that it's finally happening? Fine, I guess. Ah, uh, good luck. Let's you ready. Me. Then you gotta be over the moon to marry her. Not a big deal. Yeah, whatever. Oh, just getting mauled. Yeah. Focus not. Yeah. Gladio, do it. There we go. Look at how they were clustered together. It was a buffet. I swear I will not block as long as possible. Ignis! How are we on the same page? And we looked good was doing that perfect it. Perfect or what? I'll give you that. Still lacking the finesse. I'm okay with it. All right, let's report back to the tipster, everybody. I don't think that saved time. This is a lot of MP, though. There are skills we can research, or that's not the right term. Just get, I suppose. There's skills we can get, Dave. Man, it's hot. Then lose the jacket. No, I'm not gonna look 90s cool if I lose the jacket. Anyway, there's skills we can get to improve uh, all sorts of stuff like our MP regeneration. Pretty much anything you could think of, actually. This is a common tree for everybody, though, so... Like, hey. This would help Noctis, because he's highlighted. Warp factor. Nice. Anyway, we can work on all sorts of abilities. Can buff our stats. I gave an HP boost because, again, the uh, the lack of HP on some of my characters was a little alarming. Hey! I can walk straight. I'm not drunk, officer. Uh, oh, uh... Uh, Sid's friends, was it? Y'all did good. We did our first hunt, everybody. And we doubled our money. I can tell you all about the area. Alright, we won't be back, buddy. Have a good life. Now nothing for us but to enjoy our premium Coleman camping products. I'm afraid I have to auto-travel. That's a shame. No, I do not wish to. Everything in order. Yep. Mm-hmm. So we actually get AP. So these are just all the albums we have going here. Easy dub and bass. Gliding along. Closer. OK. 
can enjoy some different camera views. Also, you can get attacked in the car, worth noting. Oh, oh. Ignis, pull over a sec. Certainly. Well, not with that type of response time. Taking a walk on the wild side? Nothing like nature in the middle of nowhere. There's a treasure chest, that's what. There we go. We'll nab it, head back to the car. Just had to pull over. It's gonna be like roadkill or something. Found a dead coyote. A garnet bracelet. That sounds like highly valuable equipment. Enhances strength slightly. Well, sir, I gotta look out for me here. There we go. Well, I'm feeling good about uh, picking that up. Oh man, we have an opportunity, everybody. Traffic accident. Ah, darn it. I'll get you next time. Hazardous material truck. Ah, take it in. Huh. Nice place to visit, but I wouldn't want to live here. Yeah, the view is uh, a mixed bag. All right, where were we? She's out of my league, but we have so much in common. Who's the lucky imaginary lady? When all this is over, I'm gonna visit her in Hammerhead. Sydney? Oh, this is not what it sounded like. I'll take it though. We'll rock it to the prelude for a bit. Also, it looks like the regalia is not great on gas. I can live with that though. So we have some control over the icons that appear here. I guess we'll leave all of them on. Why not? Yeah, we can live with this. And you can almost see it. There we go. It's Dave, everybody. Good old Dave. I'm gonna make you do it. Sup. <laughs> Alright, we learned a valuable lesson. People drive defensively in this game. I really owe you boys one. Sup, Dave. Make that two. <laughs> Can't seem to catch a break. Yeah, life's rough. People keep doing you favors. Yeah. Now looks like they found another one. Wait, uh... Found another what? Oh, he wanted you to ask that. Uh, us hunters keep them on our person at all times as identification. What? In case you forget who you are? More in case like you die. someone else forgets who they were. Hunters lead a life of danger. Sometimes these tags are the only things that make it back in one piece. It's our job to deliver them to the families of the fallen. As it were, I came out here to do just that. <sighs> if y'all happen to find any tags lying around out there, you do me a favor and send them my way. Yeesh. Yeah. Sure. Word is, somebody spotted a tag around these parts. 
Try asking a local gypster. He'll point you in the right direction. Mm, I feel conflicted about this. All right, we'll continue the quest line, though. Those tags are heavy stuff. They certainly carry emotional weight. We'd best find and return them. And give the families peace of mind. Let's start by following up on that hot tip. I think this is going to be our tipster. I mean, the in guy could have been that too, but uh, we'll find out. I can eat a horse. You. Enjoying some fries. Welcome. Well, the world is certainly very detailed. You boys must be hungry. Think you're up to the task? Not in the mood for those. I'll just click it one more time These for good measure. Tough customers. All right, we gotta head north. I kind of thought he'd chat me up a bit, but uh, be careful. It's what I do. Man, that smells good. You dream of driving the open road. But what drives you? Passion, power, Koenig's oil. Stop by your local Koenig station and ask for Koenig's oil. You got it, advertisement. Seems trustworthy. All right, it didn't look that far. Make tracks. Chop chop, Prompto. There in a jiffy. No, not gonna let me throw it. There we go. I assume we'll regenerate MP by the time we get there. We've got a red sun at 16. If that's degrees Celsius, that's an extremely palatable temperature. Actually kind of cold. from there oh okay let's go kill it maybe this way can we go over this ledge and kind of jump down on him is what I want to know whoa hey <laughs> The color's amazing. We should make it, you know, all over our car. All right. Abort. All good? Finesse D. Don't know us for where. Feels good. All right. Now let's get out of here. Quest complete, or are we going to actually have to deliver the ham to his widow? Ugh. Nice old Saint Motel up there. Give yourself 10 Get Dave points if you enjoy their fine music. Oh, hey, cover system. Well, good to know that there's one of those. Thanks, Dave. Picking up the pieces, I guess. Well, try to keep your spirits up. And with it. No, I ain't one to talk. I beat myself up over the lives of the others I couldn't save. You dirty hypocrite. That's what each one of these tags means to me. They hurt. 
But if I let that grief keep me from looking for them, then their tags and their lives will be forgotten forever. You know, you could, like, organize a more formal military action against all these terrible wildlife. That's why I tell all my hunters to collect any tag they see. And I expect you boys to go out and do the same. I mean, just maybe having everybody do it on a solo level is not the safest. All right, well, we've got somewhere to be, I think. Everything in order. Let's roll, yep. everybody. Mm -hmm. I was thinking about this in between recordings, because this is a separate session. I just did the first two episodes of this series. We'll talk about it in a moment. Official statement regarding the forthcoming treaty. Words cannot express the joy in my heart on receiving word of this coming peace. Were we at war with the pride them? I take in my betrothal, playing a part in this historic moment. On this joyous occasion, some have voiced cause for concern. The fear I will be unable to fulfill my duties as Oracle. Please rest assured, my marriage will not stand in the way of my calling. You will find me in your towns and villages, as you always have, hmm. and I shall continue to bless you all. Lady Luna Freya will set forth from Tenebrae for her wedding ceremony in the coming days. Please be advised that during this time alone, her duties as Oracle will be suspended. It's in the treaty? Of course. Simple formality. One of those symbol of the peace deals. So it's more like a marriage of convenience. Yes. Her ladyship seems nevertheless amenable to the prospect. And Noctir likes the idea. Uh, what's that? <laughs> I do? Buzz off. Yeah, buzz off. All right, yeah, we're going past some stuff on the road, but we've enjoyed that. All right, where were we? So yeah, I was thinking about it. Um... How the game sort of has a bit of a slower pace. And I kind of think it's a good thing. Hey! I see the sea! I see it too. Really? That's Golden Key. Kind of want to go for a dip. That a big mountain behind it? No, it's an island. No, I enjoy a game with fast-paced action, but this is Take nice. Kick back and get massages. I'll say with the seafood. It's famously delicious. Sounds great. Something to look forward to. Hmm. Maybe Cindy can make it faster? Hey, not? Yeah? <sighs> I'm pretty beat. Can we call it a night and head for the hotel? That seems prudent. No use trying to change your mind. Let's go. Also, awesome! it's night time. Nap time! Indeed. Did he hit the it's curb at the end there? Night. And yet, by all accounts, it pales in comparison to old Tisha. Seriously? I've heard it's nice. Oh. Well, we could enjoy the nightlife. Got ourselves a weapon our shop, wares. though. Right by the gas station. All the guns. I wonder if they get robbed often. It's either definitely yes or definitely no. No middle ground. So this improves his magic by six, I guess? It's a nice homage to Final Fantasy VI showing who can equip a weapon. We already have our javelin, not that we've seen much of it. Uh, I'm gonna say that's Cositis. Potpourri. Spirit plus 40, sounds pretty good. Sure, we'll pick up one. Pleasure doing business. Why not? But we don't have enough money for much of anything else. I'll see you later. 
the game seems to have kind of a gradual um, like ramping up of stats and so on, so I'm not going to fret too much about missing a couple of the early ones. Like in Final Fantasy IX, that could double your damage, like the first couple pieces of equipment ain't do that much of an increase. But we've seen into the game's mechanics a little bit, and it's not quite as drastic, which is a good thing. Oh, we should do this. I'm starting to think it's ten every time. <laughs> it's really not that hard to guess at your car. And let's go check out the party trailer. There we go. 1.2 experience. In King's Night? Oh yeah, I'm game. In that case, I'll join you. It'll actually go as high as times three if you pick the right place, so hoarding experience is definitely a thing. Not that I'm a veteran of the game, but I would argue early on, uh, cashing in on some of your stuff is probably a good idea. Good shot. Well, we posed for it. <laughs> I made sure I got the regalia's good side. This is the photo we're gonna keep. <laughs> I'm glad uh, we took the opportunity to take a photo where he's like, I take a lot of personal guilt weighing me down whenever I find the dog tags of my dead friends. Great time for a photo. I just love to gas up cars. See you all in the next episode. Bye.